This presentation is brought to you by Brain Court Therapy. Identifying signs of ADD is the first step to diagnosing your child and finding a treatment plan that works. Here are some key symptoms of the disorder to look for in your child. Diagnosing your child can be a challenging task, but there are some signs of ADD to look for that can make identifying the disorder easier. Some of these signs are normal to see in children who don't have ADD. However, they will occur in a child with ADD with a much greater frequency and in higher volume. Paying attention to your child and comparing him with his peers can help make it easier to identify abnormalities in behavior. Hyperactivity is one of the most well-known signs of ADD to look for. While many children are naturally very active, hyperactive children are constantly moving. They are more than just active, displaying an inability to curb their activity appropriately. This quality can manifest itself in many ways, affecting schoolwork, home life, and interpersonal relationships. Some of the most identifiable symptoms of hyperactivity include fidgeting and squirming, inability to sit still, restlessness, difficulty engaging in quiet or relaxing activities, excessive talking, and leaving the seat moving or running around inappropriately. Inattention is another of the most commonly experienced signs of ADD. Inattention can be difficult to identify in younger children and usually becomes more apparent once the children begin school. Children will often jump from activity to activity without completing them. It isn't that they cannot pay attention under any circumstances, but people with ADD find it difficult to stay focused on repetitive or understimulating activities. As they get older, inattention will often manifest itself during social situations or while at work. Some easy to recognize signs of inattention are easy distracting, careless mistakes, trouble focusing, inattention to details, difficulty listening when spoken to, inability to sustain tasks, trouble following directions, and difficulty remembering things. Impulsive behavior and decision making can be one of the most destructive signs of ADD. Impulsivity can lead children with ADD into some troublesome situations, such as knocking into people or objects. It is also common for lack of foresight to land them in precarious positions, such as climbing too high in a tree or wandering too far from mom. Impulsive behavior is to be expected in all children from time to time, but children with ADD will exhibit this behavior on a regular basis. Some common symptoms of impulsivity include lack of patience, acting with little thought, blurting out inappropriately, difficulty waiting in line for one's turn, frequently interrupting, guessing rather than thinking through a problem, inappropriate responses, and in inability to control emotions. If you're noticing signs of ADD in your child, it is important to address them as soon as possible. It is common for children to be prescribed medications like Adderall or Ritalin, but these are not necessarily the safest or most effective treatments. Many children experience adverse side effects from these medications and the risks should be carefully considered along with the benefits. There are also a number of natural treatments that have been shown to help treat ADD. For example, neurofeedback therapy is rapidly gaining popularity as a safe and efficient treatment option. This therapy works by redirecting wayward brainwave patterns that can cause a number of neurological conditions, including anxiety, panic attacks, chronic pain, and ADD. If you'd like to learn more, please follow the link as displayed on your screen. ADD can be a challenging disorder, but while there is no cure, there are many treatment options available that have had success in treating and managing the condition. You should always consult your doctor before beginning a treatment plan for ADD. For more information, please visit our website at www.braincourttherapy.com.